morning we're out with Casey and Steve Coder great friends of ours been for years and we've been hunting this place uh, it's been a couple years because this water level hadn't been right and anyways I got a nice little hole on their property here so we've been we've been kind of eyeballing it here lately and we got just a few ducks on there so if we shoot well we should do well today it's not a whole lot of them but if we shoot well we'll come out with some good numbers so it, it's all going to depend on us because I, I do believe they'll be coming this morning so we got a great hide we got a bluebird day we're in the tree so uh, that's not going to be an issue so hopefully we shoot straight kill some ducks Oh, that's fine. She's having fun, Casey. Huh? She's having fun. She'll get it. Yeah. Get that Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, he'll get tired. He'll, he'll, he'll run out of breath for long. She's going to get him. He's gonna get him right here. Got him. Safety. Hey, hey, hey. Told you. Yeah. Sitting there like this, he can't get out. There's nowhere he's gonna go. Just ladder to the
spun around in the air and then just kept going. Spun around. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. We showed up today, we did what we said we was going to do, the ducks showed up, of course we shot well, uh, we all limited out. Main thing in this scenario for me, uh, honestly, was just having two young dogs here today working, easy marks, easy retrieves, uh, especially for Elvis, this is his first season, so it was really good for him to, to see ducks fly in, hit the water, make good marks, honor uh, journey as well when she made her retrieve. So, Today was a great day for that. Uh, anytime you get a young dog in this kind of scenario uh, with ducks flying in, and live ducks flying in and making good shots where they make good marks, I always try to take advantage of that. And that's what we did today. It was a good day hunting with Steve and Kaysen. There again, we hadn't had to hunt this place in the last couple of years, but anyways, it finally got some water, enough water in here for them and ducks migrated back in and we had a great success this morning. So. It felt good, I'm not gonna lie. It felt really good. Cause she didn't open till five, it was like 4.30. Right. She said, well, this is all I got right now. I said, I'll take it off. Loaded it. Man, this right here is full of somebody. So this is Grant Johnson. Dennis, yeah, we, we just okay, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Okay. So we got two Grants on the job. <laughs> That'll get confusing. <laughs> yeah, I'm just holler Grant. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be good to go. Finally, it's 30 degrees in Texas, and it's, uh, it's just now getting started. So, and you, you know, usually when it gets 30 degrees, only lasts three or four days. But I think this cold front's gonna be around for a while, and I think it might get. We got an opportunity to get down into the 20s. So, this morning I'm hunting with a group of guys. You know, everybody thinks I do AC for a living. I mean, uh, hunting for a living. Actually, I do AC for a living, and, and then I'm work. I'm actually Kyle is a contractor. I've done work for for several years, actually called me yesterday and had they had an extra spot on this and of course I want to take advantage of it and jump in since I came home because I actually have a meeting with a homeowner today to do a walkthrough on a house and and then I got another homeowner a different homeowner that I had to meet tomorrow as well so I had to come home and do these meetings but anyways I'm, we're here with some contractors be some plumbers be some HVAC guys here other guys be some lumber salesmen it's, uh, it's, it's one of those kind of hunts that we all try to get together and of course, I've been missing out on it the last few years, but hopefully we get a few before I have to leave. Uh, can't feel the wind really down in here, but we do have a decent south wind, so they should, you know, hopefully act right. Oh, this is northeast Texas, so basically, <clears throat> this ain't much, much, much different than a timber hole in Arkansas. So basically, it's got a few trees around it, but actually, it's just a pond. But it looks, you know, that's the thing we talk about in Arkansas is. That, you know, some of those holes that's cut out, it's no different than hunting a pond. The only thing you do is change the landscape behind it, which is trees. So basically, this is what this is. It's just a pond with trees that's grown up around it. Anyways, there's a lot of gadwater using this place right here. So that's another thing about Northeast Texas. We got a lot of gray ducks. So, uh, but anyways, there's nothing wrong with a gray duck. So that's what we're gonna be hunting today. That was gonna get a lot of work in, hopefully. Uh, they're pretty confident. If we can get these gadwalls to work in, it's holding a few. So uh, hopefully we can, we can get on them, help us get some work, and we have some fun today.
pretty awesome. Hey, there's nothing like what you say. I'm just commit and just come in. Very little bit of calling. You just hear and just bump the gab wall call a little bit and they come right in. So, hey, it's, it's a fun shoot this morning. Ellis is getting some great work, so I couldn't ask for anything better. Point guys reach out there and get them on. You hunt with a, I mean, you could sit on the east and try to shoot them sideways with a north wind, but they try to always land over there in that corner, and I mean, that's, that's a stretch to try to hit them. And they usually fly out of that corner, so it's not like they get up, you know, and fly over you. Right. Gray day on a bluebird day. Just that year. Warming up. He's just a puppy. Yeah, he's 18 months old. Yeah, he did good. He did good. He's he's great. Great. We got some work in today. Hey, Dibs, hunting these little holes like this are perfect for little young dogs. Oh, yeah, that's why I wanted to bring you. Yeah. Plus, he's been sharing, you know. With other dogs, it might be three or four. So, yeah, right, yeah, no, it's uh, yeah, one, we're not one or two ducks retrieve. Yeah, that's pretty pretty cool. Cool. Yes. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah. that's great. Most definitely. Everything just. Uh, oh man, what a shoot here in Northeast Texas with uh, Kyle and Jana. Like I said, I've been doing work with them for years and years, and, and every once in a while we were able to get out. But the last few years, our schedules didn't meet up, so I was either out of town or they was out of town, but. Fortunately, Kyle called me yesterday on the way home and invited me on this trip. And of course, I couldn't turn it down. And thank God I didn't. So it was a great shoot today. We've got a lot of gad walls, and that's that's pretty much the norm around this area. So, anyways, great time, great friends, and uh, looking forward to uh, getting back to the house and figuring out what we're going to do next.